シャドウ。Hello everyone!Welcome!Welcome!It is shadow time!Wake up!It's time to play Fortnite!Badger!Badger, it is not time to play Fortnite!It is still not installed!Hello <laughs> everyone!Welcome!Welcome! Welcome. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Wah! Wah! Streaming feels funky. It has been like two days. I don't know, it feels weird. <laughs> feels weird. Feels like. Feels like it's been forever, you know what I mean? Mm hmm. I miss you too, I miss everyone very, very much. It is good to be back, but still. Still, it feels strange. After, you know. A stream that big. I'm gonna take my sweatshirt off. I'm already warm. Buckle. Buckle, Shadow. I've been very cold all day, but then the minute. The minute that I sit on the screen. Nothing, nothing, nothing. I'm warm. <laughs> no, do not say it like that. Gazoo. Oh no, put it on the floor. Why? Yeah, ducky ducky. Ducky ducky. <laughs> ducky ducky after many hours of... Of no streaming. How many hours has it been since I streamed? Any mathematicians? Any mathematicians in chat? Anyone who knows how to count bigger than six? I'll be impressed. I'll be very impressed if you can count bigger than six. I'll show you my ankles. If you can count bigger than oh, first sound, that's amazing. Holy heck. Okay, the one first, you win. Here are my ankles. Please enjoy. Oh no. Not feet, don't look at the feet. I was not showing you the feet. I was showing you the ankles, silly. Mm-mm. Mm-mm-mm. Not a foot tuber, ankle tuber, ankle tuber. Only ankles, do not perceive the feet. I did not show you them. You cannot just take whatever you want. You cannot just perceive whatever you want to perceive. Zephyrin, I have been awake for... Eight hours, I think. Eight hours. Eight hours. It's okay, James. One of my ankles was covered. One of them was covered. That means I'm only 50%. Loot streamer. Nothing, nothing, nothing. Mm -hmm. Very mature, sexy lady. That is me. Sexy lady streams. Talks about my big boobies and all. Uh, makes a joke about hand holding without consent and all. Uh, I don't know how to be a loot streamer. Freaking <laughs> boing boing. Yeah! No, I ran out of things to say. I will be a terrible loot streamer. I don't know. I don't watch many loot streamers. I don't know many of them. I know all the few of them. And I've seen a few clips, but... To be honest... I don't really understand what a loot streamer entails. I do kind of admire it though, because I just tried to think of three loot things I could do, and I was one thing short, so... Ah. Uh. How did I just keep thinking of things to say? That's what I don't know. <laughs> Hi, Pearl! Hello! Welcome! How are you doing? For the owner, Tom. Thank you, 
thank you for the 11 months. Thank you very much. Welcome, welcome. And welcome, welcome to everyone else too, of course. Today we are gonna be doing some art. Loot streamers spent all year perfecting their instruments. I'm gonna be honest, I don't know many loot streamers. I don't even know what that is. Oh man, that's a funky looking guitar. That's like a guitar for funky people. It looks like they snapped it. And then glued it back together. And then got a big nail file and filed it into a circle. And I don't know how I feel about that. What are we doing today? We are going to be drawing. Yeah. We're gonna be working on the drawing I did from the charity singles. But before that, I think we're gonna design the outfit for the 3D model that won the charity stream goal poll. Yeah. <laughs> Something like that. Something like that. Yeah. Uh, the outfit of one was a sweater with tights. So I think the sweater will have to be pretty big. Big and comfy. I don't know about hair style. <laughs> we'll have to think about it. Have to use all of our brain cells. Yeah, and the drawing that I'm doing is a onesie. Bunny onesie. I was sketching it before. And I have a clean sketch now so we can line it. But I think I need to think about the sketch a little more because I don't really know what I want to do for the background. Let me see. My floor is so they made me coffee. Oh, the sound of me fell in. I don't think we're like that here. I don't think anyone's like that. Maybe all... Uh, maybe we're projecting. Have you considered? Maybe we're projecting. <laughs> <laughs> I think we're pretty, uh... Wholesome. I guess. Yeah. I don't have any horns either. My head is horn free. Free of horns. <laughs> I think we make funny jokes sometimes, but... I don't think anyone here has like actual your buy intentions. I just don't see it as that kind of place. When I stream, the goal is to have like... Mm, like a safe and comfortable place for everyone. Yeah. Keep my wife's name out your damn mouth! <laughs> You know, they say the chat usually reflects the streamer, so when I stream, I try to make a relatively cozy, comfy place for everyone. I think most people are pretty chill, but uh, people who do not fit the vibe usually get yeeted pretty quickly or turned out and asked to fix the vibe, and if they do not, then they get sent to the shadow realm. Which is, uh, contrary to popular belief, not the realm where I am. It is actually the shadowless realm. The realm less of shadows. <laughs> Something like that. Can I run TV chat? Is she be good? I don't expect that. I have watched quite a few of her scenes, but I'll be honest, quite a lot of the time when. When I watch streams, 
I'm usually doing something. Like, uh... Mm, working on stuff and drawing, so I'm not usually reading the chat very much. Usually just listening to the stream and glimpsing at the screen now and again. You want to call her sis, or... Mm, I guess not, but... I don't think she likes it unless I've told her things, so that's... Maybe, maybe I'm getting confused. I don't know. I don't know. Yeah, I, I, I just perceived her as Mimi. Yeah. Making the funny jokes. <laughs> She's a lot of fun, though. A lot, a lot of fun. Ah, uh, Oni-chan? 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 Uh <laughs> <laughs> is hard. I don't know if it's because I was sick, but you may be able to tell. Just say, we have to cook. I'm a little bit croaky still. Thank you for the water moment, Badger. I'm a little croaky. I cannot go very deep right now, I apologize. Which are uh, maybe concerning because we're supposed to be singing for like six hours tomorrow. No, I didn't just wake up. I've been, I've been up for a while. My voice keeps like catching. I don't think it's because we streamed for a while. I think it's just because, uh. Mm. I think it's just because I've been a little bit ill. I spent quite a lot of time sleeping the last few days. Did a lot of sleeping. I slept for accidentally like 10 hours last night. When I was supposed to be working on things. I think it's because I, uh, I have not been very well. I've had a bit of a fever the last few days. I have a fever during the charity stream. It has gone down. I'm down to about 102 right now. So I was at like 104. And I peaked it at 104.7. I think a little bit after the stream. Yeah, that's how it is. Charity stream did it to me. <laughs> yeah, we will do the karaoke stream, but... I called it a quote-unquote endurance karaoke, but if my voice gets tired, I am gonna stop. Mm -hmm. We're just gonna sing. I did plan on singing until 30k, but I don't think it's gonna be possible. Unless we get like a huge raid or something. Yeah. Insanity Fallon, can you please stop the self promo stuff? Because we don't do that here. Mm -mm. Okay? Just warning ya. <laughs> okay. Let us uh, say hello. Let us say hello to everyone. Yeah. Yeah, I uh, someone made a big donation after the stream ended. And uh, that tipped us over the 10k. <laughs> So, we did it. We killed cancer. Twice. Clown <laughs> Shadow, I'm in a solitude. Hello, blah, blah, blah. Hello, Nixie. Hello, Slide. I'm like, Clown Shadow, so blah. Hello, the dude. Hello, Slimeball. Clown Shadow, I'm Toki. Hello, Zephyrin. Hello, Swagnamite. Hello, Louie. Hello, Nixie. Hello, Aces. FK. Hello, Gans from Clara. Hello, Fushats. Yes, Daki Makura. Hello, Jordan. Hello, Sukla. Hello, James. Hello, Mammy Myth. Hello, Lalek. Hello, Insanity Phone. Hello, Aeon. Hello, JV3FP. Hello, Ron Potato Guy. Hello, Oliver Leo. Hello, Swagnamite. Hello, Denti. Hello, I do it. Hello, ironic the gold. Look, ironic golem. Hello, cute kids. 
Hello, Ascara. Hello, Flawed Intellect. Hello, Flamingo. Hello, Magneto Master. Hello, Party Bone. Hello, School Band. I'm happy to see you too. <laughs> Hello, Lily. Hello, Moose G. Hello, Michael Curtis. Hello, Hello, Curvo. Hello, Insert. Hello, Sikwa. Hello, Curious. Hello, Lime Consumer. Hello, I'm Amazing Ur. Hello, Badger. Hello, Marius. Hello, Asius FK. Hello, Flamingo. Hello, V and PC Arts. Hello, Celia Tiki. Hello, WWWMNMWWWW. Wow, my voice is cracked. I'm a 12 year old boy. Welcome to the stream. Hello, host for you. Hello, I Sophie. Hello, Z Larkin. Hello, Dr. Dracula. Hello, Lodgin. Hello, I like birds. Hello, Sonic Hero. Hello, EC2. Hello, Musical Ducky. Hello, X Nilo. Hello, regular board guy. Hello, Slime Ball. Hello, Money Owl. Hello, The Camus. Hello, D. Come meows. Hello, yous. Hello, deal place. Hello, Dawn. Hello, Ty. Hello, Hosfeel. And, hello, Sukwa. Hello, Lily. Hello, Otto Frost. Hello, everyone. Welcome, welcome. Nilo, I have been remembering how to say your name for months now, okay? Okay, it's been months. It's been months. Don't hold it against me. <laughs> hello, friends, hello, hi. And hello, Kosian. san Ohio. Ohio. <laughs> what time is it in Japan? Isn't it like 3 a.m.? 2 a.m.? Konbawa? Eh? <laughs> Why does the middle of the night tie into that? Kawaii arigato. Why? Why is there not a greeting in Japanese? There is a greeting for morning. Generally through the day and for evening, but there is none for the middle of the night. What do you say if it's 3 a.m.? Nothing, nothing, nothing. <laughs> I'm gonna sip my coffee. Greeting for vampires. Kukensky Greeting What made you want to become an ASMR artist? Uh, I watched ASMR since like 2014 And I really liked it I always wanted to do it But I don't like the idea of showing myself on video Obviously times have changed I'm right here in front of you, face to face <laughs> But back then I was a little shy. So then I found some audio only in some my real place and I was like, this is it. They made it for me. Heck yeah. Mm. I'll also run a quick app. Thank you, Salam Dina. Thank you. How is everyone doing? How is your weekend? Are you doing good today? I was birthed for the sole purpose of doing it some more. Yeah. Yeah. I'm glad you think so. I don't know. I was worried that I'm not very good at it some more considering how long I've been listening to it. I don't know. I know this is the part where everyone's gonna go, Shadow, you are good at ASMR. But, uh, I don't know. I feel like you have to say that. It's not objective. I'm looking for 
objective feedback. Unlocking you. Unlocking you. <laughs> you are too predictable. I want to all sus out. Emphasis on the source. That is how you sound and see. Then so when you talk you go me 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 <laughs> Anyone else? Anyone else gonna contend? Contend that is how they sound. Come on, tell me you don't sound like that. <laughs> me, 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 me. <laughs> Cause all Jackie's an idol. Cause you're gaki, nope. Not cause you're gaki. Very polite. Nothing, nothing, nothing. I only speak the objective truth. Is that your natural voice? Yeah, my natural voice in language. I go me 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 me. <laughs> no, how am I cause you're gaki? How? All I do is speak the truth. If anything, you are the Kusogaki. If anything, you are. Because you are the one. Being cheeky. I will correct you immediately. Are you prepared? Kiss mm -hmm. correction. <laughs> You, you can all get in the song making my meme. I found out what it meant like three months ago. And I'm gonna keep, keep joking about it now. That's it. You corrupted me. Now I have the forbidden knowledge. It's like when uh, I taught Sylvie what the war means. <laughs> And then I sat her in my tummy and she was like, Whoa! <laughs> and this is all I know for. It's a cycle of corruption. I've been corrupted. I didn't mean to corrupt anyone. I didn't do anything. I was the one who was corrupted. Mm-mm. Mm -mm -mm. You know, before I started streaming and became a part of the VTubing community and became a VTuber myself, there were so many things, I just didn't know what they meant. And I have been taught so many things. Every day, I learn new things. I don't know if that's good or bad. I've been taught many things. Mm -mm. Society. Not this power. I don't know if this is a good type of shadow education. It's always good to learn new things. I don't know what. I don't know. Yeah. I learned what the funny numbers mean, as well. Uh, I think that was Ty's fault because of his funny tag stream. Actually. There was uh, the funny numbers, when people post the funny numbers. And they're talking about the cursed sexy mangas. Yeah. I didn't know what those were. But then, then I learned what the bad numbers mean. And then I, then everything clicked, everything made sense.
It was a little bit scary. Ty, when you put the funny... The funny tags on your head. During the Undertale screen. I'm sure that was why I learned what the funny numbers meant. It was the same day. I don't know if it was directly you. But that was when I learned the funny numbers. Nothing has been the same. I also learned... What else have I learned? Oh yeah! I was watching... I was watching Sylvie's Day some more soon. I think it was about a week ago. And she asked me whether I... I was watching it and I was in her chat. And... I don't know what triggered it, but she asked me what type of Subun I was. And I was so confused. I was like... I'm a fork. <laughs> At least it didn't seem like that. I thought this was like a personality test thing. I don't know what I thought. When people mention spoons to me, the first thing I think of is like baking. Like, uh, teaspoons, tablespoons, dessert spoons. We use that in baking. And then she told me that wasn't what it meant. A teaspoon is the little spoon. The little one. Not funny. Yeah, uh... I guess I'm a little spoon. I don't understand this. Why do they refer to the people as spoons? Yeah, I guess, I guess it is, but I googled it then. I don't know how I had actually never heard of that one before. Because it wasn't even like... I thought it might have been like... A weeb thing, you know what I mean? You know, like a funny weeb tag. But it seems that it's not even like a Japanese thing, it's just a normie thing. Normies. It doesn't make sense. Why would you call it spooning? I'm not a spoon. I'm a flesh person. Normies. Normies. So that was my, uh, my learning of last week. I don't know. I don't know what my learning of this week will be. Does anyone want to teach me something? Hugging while sleeping. Doesn't that seem uncomfortable though? Hugging while you asleep. I cannot... Mm. I don't know, it just seems like a little bit awkward. To me. Your ducky is fine with it, I'm sure. <laughs> I don't know. I don't like the thought of anyone touching me while I'm asleep. When I... When I'm sleeping... I sleep like in the fetal position. With my knees to my chest. And uh... I don't like the thought of someone touching me. I don't know, that doesn't seem comfy to me. I don't think I would be able to sleep. I think I would be nervous. Or like, uncomfortable. When I sleep, I want to sleep by myself with my cat. <laughs> nice and warm. My bed isn't very big though. Not supposed to be this anyone. How many relationships do you think I've been in? Like one. <laughs> Come on. Thirty thousand. Thirty thousand. 
Not quite yet. I don't know. I don't know. None of you... None of you have hugged me, though. I don't know if that's a good thing or a bad thing. Last person I hugged was Mama Shadow. <laughs> many, many husbands. Let me stretch. Yeah. I don't know, I don't like the thought of sleeping with anyone in my bed. My bed is small though. Do you mind sleeping on the couch? <laughs> no, no. You can sleep. I'll have to get a very big bed. You can sleep like relatively far away. Far away. Poor, poor. It is Mama Sama's birthday tomorrow. I feel mean for saying that. I just don't touch me while I'm sleeping. I'll wake up and cry. <laughs> I like to sleep by myself. With my cat. He's the only person I feel safe sleeping with. No sleeping before marriage, like ever. Ever. You just don't sleep, you're awake until the day you get married. That seems kind of uh, tiring. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, head power range is good, but I don't know. Don't look at me while I'm sleeping. Sometimes I wake up because Mama Shadow is just standing above me, staring at me. She does that. No peeking. Okay. Okay, rules of sleeping with a shadow. I'll make it. We'll make it official. I'll make a list. That rules. The rules. Okay. I gotta, I gotta set my, my barriers. Are you ready? Are you prepared for this? I gotta tell you, I gotta lay down the rules. Okay. Rule one. Uh, for enough of a personal breathing cold in ball space, but close enough. Head party. Well, to. Mm. Yeah, well, to invalidate. Well, one, if your name is Morley and you are a cat. Well, three. Wear clothes. No naked bodies in my bed. Rule four. You have to tell my mama one day in advance before the sleepover. Rule four. Five. You have to bring your own shampoo. Rule six. There seems to be a lot of rules, huh? <laughs> <laughs> what? Did you think it would be easy? <laughs> you forgot your toothbrush. Yeah, you must be warm. You must. Well, seven. You may not enter the bed until you have offered 20 head pass as sacrifice to the Sunder Lords. Well, eight. You. Cannot lick the forehead. That. Oh. 
That is not your territory. Do not lick it, do not lick it. Pillow situation. There isn't too many pillow rolls because I only need one pillow to sleep. I cannot sleep on two, so you can have my others. Mm. 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 I feel like there should be more rules. No tickling. Well, then, when I switch off the light, that means what's up? Go to freaking sleep. I think that's a pretty good list. Wait. For 11. No shouting in the night. Or mama. Well, shout at me. Roll 12. No staring. No staring. No staring. Touching is allowed. We can hold hands, maybe. Just... I don't know. I like to sleep curled up into a little ball. Do not touch me. <laughs> I cannot sleep any other way. I tried sleeping on my, uh, mother's side and I cannot. I try sleeping on my back. Mm -mm. I cannot sleep any other way but in one position. And I think if anyone else came and tried to throw off my groove, this wouldn't be a sleepover. This would be a wakeover, you know what I mean? Maybe hand hoody. Oh, that's a good rule. Rule 13. No eating the shamba. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. The bed is a eat free zone. There you go, you can read that, right? I'll keep that there for you, uh, for you to refer to. Can we eat outside the bed? If it's done with love and respect. That, those are vaguely bedtime related rules. I think we should have rules for... Also, when you're just hanging out in my place. I think we need some of those as well. Okay? Hanging out at the forest cabin rules. Okay, you ready? I'm making not light so you can read it. Can you read it? I hope so. Okay, rules for hanging out at the forest. Hanging out in my place. Rule one is pretty much the same as the other ones, okay? You have to tell Shadow Mama at least one day in advance before you come over. Mm -hmm. It is important to tell my mama because she might be busy. And if she's busy, who's going to make sure that we're okay and take care of us? Rule 2. Unlimited head pass. Rule 3. Ah. Uh, you must... Princess carry me wherever... I want to go Rule 4 If we are playing video games Your lap is my chair Rule 5 If we are sitting anywhere Your lap is my chair 
Rule six, bring chocolate. Rule, rule seven, talking a lot. Other girls immediately disqualifies you to outside, even if it's raining. Rule eight. Uh, oh, you're right, you're right. No Hershey's, we must clarify. No Hershey. Mm -mm. Rule eight. Uh, I may demand at any time that you spoon feed me instead of feeding myself. Rule 9. Reese's is okay. I... Reese's is not that good. Tie. <laughs> Reese's is not very good. But I kind of like it. And like a guilty pleasure kind of way. You know what I mean? The chocolate tastes really cheap, but it's a guilty pleasure. Hershey's is just gross, but Reese's, I will eat Reese's. Uh, rule nine. Rule nine. You may hug or that pillow whenever required. Well, ten. You have you have to beat the hard bosses for me. If I ask, ah, uh, no backseating, no. Well, I love it. Mm. 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 Yeah, I like peanut butter, Lily. Ah. Uh, hmm. I choose the music we listen to. And you have to listen to it. Rule 12. If we watch a movie, I will talk over it. Rule 13. Six kisses are legal. You gotta, you gotta, uh, I, I don't think there's anybody else. Forehead is off limit. Mm -hmm. That is more than territory. Oh, you're right. Time. Rule 14. You may pet the cat. That applies to both me and also Marley. Hi, Nina. Ah, uh, rule 15. Nobody. Mm -mm. Rule 16. There's a lot of rules. Is there too many rules? You think I'm too high maintenance? What if he pets us? <sighs> we may have a problem. Not enough. I agree. No excessive bullying. No. My house, my rules. Oh, wait. No eating. Mm -mm. Marley will not lick your forehead. He only licks mine. He doesn't even lick Mama's house. Only mine. Ah. Uh, Ah, 
942. Yeah, you can eat some of the chocolate. Maybe I'll feed it to you. You feed me. I feed you. Oh. Uh. Think that's a pretty good. Pretty good. <laughs> Rose list. <laughs> yeah? No, me are. You can read that right. There you go. They're all there for you. Refer to them any time that you like. <laughs> Should have read the fine print before you hit follow. <laughs> Your mistake, not mine. <laughs> yeah, just just get it out. Uh, you reading glasses out, old man? I'm bullying you. <laughs> hey, then excuse yours. Go recompile the kernel. <laughs> You don't have time to... You don't have time to come over to my house and have a sleepover the next users because you're too busy. You're too busy trying to type in 700 lines of code to open the email to read the invitation. You'll never get here on time. Your free and fair schedule, yes. They gotta, they gotta actually free up our schedule sometime. Nee, 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 nee. We gotta play something, maybe. I'm gonna sip my tea. Oh. Mm. Yeah, the next users are like gamers, they don't have time for girls. Too busy explaining to everyone why, uh, why they sit down with Linux. And, uh, they're like vegans. Holy heck, Linux users are like vegans. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Ziki, all I said is no other girls in my house. That's all I said. I mean, I cannot stop you when you're outside of my house. Yeah, and also I'm God plus ratio. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I forgot to include that. You must also retrieve things from the top self. And this is your only purpose. No matter what you're doing, I don't care if it's an online game. Can't pause it. Me 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 me. Me 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 me. <laughs> Short hidden gym. I mean, you're taller than me, probably. I never said how tall the top shelf is. Yeah, you can lift me up to reach it if you want. Isn't it harder to pick someone up to reach the top shelf than Princess Carrie? Yeah, the rules kind of benefit you too. They're fair rules. I'm a fair god. Mm -hmm. Height isn't that important as long as you are taller than me. 
That's all I really care about. I can be like one inch taller and that's fine. You are a Viking no matter what. We're the same height, you are very small. <laughs> you are very small, I will allow it. Well, hi to you. I will take my shoes off so it's, un so it's fair. I am. 137 centimeters. There you go, you got even more wiggle room now. Yeah. Let me see my tea is going cold. What volume? 100%! Big! <laughs> In American units, about four foot five, four foot six. I don't know. Uh -huh. Small, but not too small. Uh. Four foot and five point nine three seven inches. It's four foot six. <laughs> we round in this house. <laughs> A massive gargantuan four foot six. Round on baby, like a guy on Tinder. <laughs> Do I wear high heels? No, I wear slight platforms. They make me just a little bit taller. You see? Platforms. Shoes have platforms. Step. Oh no. Step. Step. <laughs> Of course you're looking respectfully. Why would you look disrespectfully? That would be rude and disrespectful. Mm -hmm. Ah, Mammy Miss, thank you for eight months of two true. Thank you very much. Gang guys, yeah, buddy. Thank you for three months. Thank you. Thank you very much. Ah, uh, hello, Shando. Three months already. Love to be here. I really love having you, so thank you. Thank you very much. Sugeri, thank you for three months, thank you. Come on, And Eggs and Nyla, thank you for the two gifts up, thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you, thank you. I'm gonna search. <laughs> yeah. Then perhaps it is time to do some art. Perhaps. Yes. Uh. Hmm. So we design the costume first. I was thinking of it. I will just grab my art tablet really fast. No, we'll just we'll work on the outfit because that won't take very long because it's simple. Yeah. Oh, trigger warning. Trigger warning. Window sounds. Window sounds incoming. You cannot escape them. Trigger 
the one out. Prepare yourself. Oh. I moved my arm too far. I forgot that I have 0, 0.0 cubic meters of space. Yeah, mute now, mute now, you're about to hear it. Three, two, one. We are safe. If you were offended by that, I'm very sorry. It wasn't my intent to hurt you. Cause you despair. Okay. Here we have this week's schedule. Welcome to Sai. Alright, there's nothing visible. One second. Shkosh, shkosh. Oh no, there's so much on my desk, so I cannot find it. Okay. Here's one I made earlier. There. there we go. Yeah, Clip Studio Gang can frick off. Uh, please look respectfully. Here's an image I prepared before stream. You better be looking respectfully. No, it's okay, Jim. There's no Linux users here. We filtered them. I'm Seattle. Uh, don't look at this disgraceful image on the screen. Oh no, don't look. Do not perceive. Welcome. Welcome, Raiders. Hello, we are just doing some art today. How was your stream? Huge red. Holy heck. What were you up to? I'm Seattle. We do games. We do ASMR. Today we are working on some art. Just last week I did a big charity scene. And we raised thirteen thousand dollars, ten thousand GBP for charity, cancer research, and we're doing some art for the vaults. We're gonna be designing a costume that will be a summer 3D model, and we will also be mm, uh, working on what this means is funny. <laughs> Think gas is a simulator. <laughs> I actually had that game, I think. Was it fun? Is it fun? Did you enjoy it? It was amazing. I was amazed by how it went. My 3D model. Me? No, I'm two dimensional. I rigged very well. By all. Uh, I was gonna say real quick, oh mama, but she drew me. I was rigged by Cop Mama and Iron Vertex. Mm hmm. Yes. <laughs> it made you cry. That was not my intention. I'm very sorry. How are you in that sonnet? Eh? <laughs> is gas station sim good then? It is. I like those funny simulator games. They please me. I find them very entertaining. Okay, you must... You Raiders, you must perceive very politely. 
Only... Only polite proceeding permitted, okay? Polite proceeding permitted. No ribbons right now. This is the, uh... It's default Shondo. Tipo Shondo. There's a Simfest on scene. Oh! I don't have to check that out. <laughs> polite proceeding permitted. So if you want to stick around and just hang out with us Raiders, we will be doing that. If you like something to do, I understand. No worries. <laughs> and Cecil, if you need to go do something, streaming, streaming makes me hungry and tired, so yeah. You wanna go do that? <laughs> so. What we really decided was that it would be a big sweater, big enough to, big enough to not need pants, so we must tread carefully. I was thinking turtleneck. No pants. No pants on this sweater. Gonna go eat? Mm -hmm. Have a nice eat. I will. Thank you so much for the raid. I'm not sure what color it should be. I wanna make it really big though. I'm not sure how big we can legally make it though. How big is legal? Legally huge sweater. <laughs> oh, it can be your sweater. I was thinking of making it like really cute and girly though. I don't know. Let's get a basic shape and then we'll consider what we want to design. Do we want to make it to the fingies? If it was your sweater, it would be like... <laughs> that might be too a bit. You won't be able to see anything. I'm gonna make it look like it's like an adult sweater, but it's too big. You know, I have a bike closer in the kids section. Does that surprise anyone? I have a lot of stuff that's about eight, eight to nine. I was wearing a zero zero for a while, but... Those don't fit right. Mm. Like this, maybe? I love big sliders. I love big sweaters. Big sweater is comfy. But the question is how big? How long? Maybe this? I don't know if my stuff fits me though, I haven't worn clothes in a while. <laughs> and I have definitely gained a little weight. Chalky. <laughs> when those sleeves come over, I think they would. That makes the most sense. It's always hard to decide whether the sleeve holes, sleeve, arms, tongue and I'm still on the way. I 
I just feel chunky. Oh, uh, I'd have to gain quite a lot of weight to not be underweight. Not say again, but I mean like five pounds max. <laughs> Why are you trying to make me fat? Why does feeders are real? Mm -mm. Doesn't matter how much food you send, I'm only gonna eat so much of it. Not on the way. I have really thick thighs naturally, so they touch if I'm even like borderline a healthy weight. And I hate the feeling when my thighs touching. I hate it. And on the top, they rub together just a little bit. Mm -mm. I hate it. I don't want them to touch whatsoever. What about shoulders? How do you feel about shoulders? Everyone who is an American, no wonder you are to make me fat. <laughs> Do people actually like shoulders? Nothing, nothing, nothing. Actually like them. I don't know what follows you mean. Cause I know in the US, your school system. It's like, no shoulders. Oh my god. If I see a shoulder, I'm gonna explode. Maybe I could make it bigger. What if everything is shoulder? Too much, too much. When they're attached, it's all you like. But then not apply to everyone though. Or like every everything. So you also like the weird toes. What if they have weird feet? Do you like them? Is there a cat she's someone you like? Hmm. <laughs> What about that? <laughs> Toes. I don't really understand. I don't have weird feet. I have perfectly normal feet. They're normal. Normal size, normal, mm, maybe a little small. My hands are small too, so that makes sense. The neck is really big, really, really big, like this. Yeah. Yeah, I'm, I'm being silly, but do you think there is anyone who would actually, if if they were dating someone and they have webbed feet, they would just be like, no, I hate you, freak off. Really? If you actually love someone? Hmm. That seems rude. A lot of people are petty, yeah, but surely not that petty. 
That's a level a thousand pity. And also, um, some people can be really pity about stupidest things like height. And the uh, weight and stuff. I don't really get webbed feet though. How often do you see someone's feet? And you don't see my feet very often. Toes. I don't have a lot of toes. Maybe that's to do with some feet drawing grips. Good I'm at for the image. My feet are already modeled anyway. Uh oh, it's disproportionate. That's okay. I can fix that. I can fix it. I can fix her. Must have messed something up. That's okay. It's not completely symmetrical. That is a little bit. I can fix the feet. <laughs> we should play some funky country music on. So you don't get like bored of my BGM. Honestly, I would never get bored of my BGM. But I know there's been a... Uh... Mm. Are you ever watching a VTuber stream? And they have their uh, BGM on. Like the same 30 second cycle for like three hours. And you're like, hmm. Hmm. <laughs> and you just start to go and change the event insane. You know what I mean? Do you know what I mean? Surely. Surely I'm not the only one. Yeah, variation is good. I don't want you to get spoiled. I'm listening to my BGM whenever you want. <clears throat> okay, I'm glad I'm not the only one. Brain rot. BGM brain rot. Alright. The same one every day would probably drive you a little bit insane. Even if it's good BGM, you know what I mean? A lot of VTubers only have one BGM track. I think it's even worse if it's not original music. It's just, you know... Hmm... <laughs> They're working at radio. I don't know. Being a big stream viewer, I think, helps me to avoid falling into a few of the traps that I notice. It's not a his deal or anything, but... I wonder what color it should be. Maybe white? Now it's like pantyhose, and they look good. We made it to a land. We haven't decided what we're doing with the hair yet, so... Lila 
black. Maybe we'll put the rest of the colors in another slide. Has anyone got any suggestions for the hair song? Haven't considered. Need some f cool, cool flame decals. Oh man. We do be trying to outline the hair. Done when I see we're done. <laughs> long flowing hair, long flowing hair always paints an image of maturity. I don't know if I'm ready for that. <laughs> I maybe have an idea. I'll give me a minute. One ponytail that it comes from the top of my head and in front of my face like a unicorn. Ponytail is also a very mature image. Sometimes when a character has a ponytail, she comes off as very grown up and cool. Do you see me as grown up and cool? Answer yes. You don't know how to answer that? There's one way to answer that. Or nibbling? Answer is yes. <laughs> ah, I've been very stressed over the back behind the scenes like stuff lately. Like, the new costume and stuff has been stressing me out because the uh, time has been coming up for when Ivy needs to falls but her Goku Mama isn't finished even though she says she would be finished she's been busy and had stuff come up which is completely understandable, of course you know, life happens, but it has been stressing me Yeah. There's not really anything I can do about it. Yeah. It's hard to kind of be in the middle now. I'm boring. Yeah, the music is an um, Undertale Bullet Fly Mix. Yeah, I hate when things like that are happening, like when you have deadlines. They're not your deadlines. <laughs> There's a lot of stuff that goes on behind the scenes with VTubing and that. But it's not to think about it. I have to though, I need to be in constant contact with both of them. And then there is a bunch of other projects I need to... Get on to... Because I've been waiting for this costume for uh, almost a year. And uh, if Ivy pushes it back, they'll probably push it back until next year. Because they're very busy. And I really don't want that. Because I'll slow down the pressure real quick on Mama. I 
I already paid for everything, so... Yeah. Well, I didn't pay for rigging, but... You know what I mean? I just guess you... Guess you call us to us, you know? Yeah. Can always ask. I have asked quite a few times. She's very busy. Very, very busy, Mama. Back when, uh, when I first contacted her, there wasn't many VTuber children at all. Now there's like nearly 20, there was three when I first contacted her. Just crazy to think about. Yeah, I'm sure it'll work out. I know I'm just getting overstressed for some no reason. Cause she's gonna give me the files and everything will be okay, but Yeah. You know what I'm like. There's not really anything to stress about, but yeah, absolutely. You see why? Nothing, nothing, nothing. Because she's amazing. She is. She's an incredible artist, and her rates were much too low last year. It's unfortunate a lot of artists still. I got seal. It does. Unfortunately. Especially when you're dealing with like a thousand other things as well. to let stress eat you up. It's really hard. I did my best to try and balance it, but it can be hard not to let it consume you. This is I waited a very long time for real like Mama. And I waited a very long time for Iron Vertex as well. And they were both the best of the best and so amazing to work with. And I'm so lucky that I can work with both of them. The problem is both of them are also very busy and have you know, very tight schedules. And sometimes their schedules don't overlap very well. You know what I mean? Yeah. And also, yes, I'm very busy as well. <laughs> Everyone is busy. Oh no, what have I done? I messed it up somehow. Okay. Yeah. 
Merci. It does feel nice knowing that I can spill a little bit of what's been concerning me up to you. It definitely makes me feel better, so thank you. For listening to me being a bot. <laughs> But I'm really looking forward to the outfit. We're gonna really like it. I hope. I'm trying not to think about the stream when I show it too much yet, because it's still a while off. But... I do plan on having like... It will not be as big as my debut, so do not expect it to be. But I do plan on having like a little bit of a... A little bit of a syndic, you know what I mean? Yeah, that was a little bit of a thing. No, not <laughs> Tiki. No. the message across. Do you miss Chida does? Yes. <laughs> also, I think I am going to have to take a break. We, uh, we talked about this. Well, I talked about it. On my old Twitter. Uh, a week or two back, I talked about how I might need to take a small break from streaming because I have so much work to do as much as I love streaming. Mm, I'm not able to get these things done because of streaming. So if I get these things done, then I can return to streaming without worry. Yeah. You know what I mean? Everything that I've kind of been pushing aside to stream as much as I have been has caught up to me now. <laughs> it's caught up to me. I have so much work to do. So I think I gotta take a small break to just catch up with everything. Yeah. It won't be long, but not a week. I think I will, after this week, stream one more week and then take a small small break. Basically, I plan on it just being a week. Just a week of not streaming. Yeah. Yeah. You'll still see me on the Discord. On the Twitter. It is not time for myself to get close up. Uh, even though it sounds like mm -hmm. I'm taking a, a fun hangout and doing nothing break, that's not what I'm doing. I'm taking a work break. So I can work on stuff. <laughs> I wish I could take a nice break break. You know, just breathe for a little bit, but 
You don't play some video games, maybe. No freaking time. <laughs> maybe one day. That day is not here, though. Ah. Uh. So let's see it all. And then, maybe I'll feel ready to return the video soon as well. At least start thinking about it. I play video games on occasion when I have the time, but... Ever since I started streaming, I have no time. <laughs> Not that... There is a lot that goes on behind the scenes. Um, I'm a pretty low energy person. So I, I know I'm not the most high energy streamer, but I think when I play games and stuff, I'm relatively high energy. You know what I mean? I'm relatively high energy. And I'm gaming. Like streams like today, I'm pretty low energy. Just drawing and chatting. But I have a very, very low social battery. And, uh... Yeah, I think I have very a lot, which is nice, I think. I have a very, very low social battery. So being super bouncy, off the walls, criminally insane for a few hours even, it drops my battery for the day, I'm drained then. So I struggle to work on other things after streams a lot. I mean, I'm, d I'm definitely not trying too hard or anything when I, like, that is just a part of who I am. I am a crazy chaos gremlin sometimes, but also being like that makes me tired. <laughs> Hi, Mary Squid. How you doing? And hello, welcome to Toxics. Hello. Welcome, welcome. Do you have been... A little bouncy for a few hours, even. Pew, sound on it. I, I think I've told you before that sometimes after I stream, I just sit there and I just slouch in my chair for like an hour and like go brain dead because I'm so wiped. Yeah. I think I've talked about that before. I feel like we should add something here, in the middle, to be a little empty space. I'm good, how's it feeling? I'm good, just easing back into it. Mm -hmm. She's just like me. She's so cool and relatable. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Chess window. Why would you want that? There's nothing to perceive. <laughs> She's literally me. Oh my god, guys. You should watch my, my streamer. She's so cool and relatable. Maybe the necklace? She's just like me. <laughs> Open back. What if you could see the back? Coming board window.
other something. Sadly, the universe will not permit it. Purple necklace. Like a pendant? Pendant, maybe. Bow. Mmm, I think it's a little much. But the bow is here. Three in a row. Three in a bow. Maybe we'll go with the pendant. Yeah, the mirror tool is a godsend. If you're making something like a model, 3D or 2D, you kind of need it. Dirty gold necklaces and four gold watches drip. <laughs> New costumes soon. This will be for my 3D model. We are, uh, this idea, big sweater, and touch this one paw. Yes. This is the... Oh... I wonder what we should design. Hmm... Let's see... Hmm... <laughs> like that... Like silver... I only wear silver necklaces. I don't like gold. Gold is tacky. Maybe that's a controversial opinion. Gold is tacky. White gold is nice. I usually wear platinum though. Not that I wear jewelry very often. Platinum is nice. I don't know, I always thought that gold was tacky. Always thought this. What color should it be in the middle? Hmm. Doors are being slammed in my house. Sounds like a good sign. Perhaps there is an invader within the forest. This Titanic necklace. Dun, 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 dun. Green looks pretty nice. Sure. I like it. Blood red pendant. Good. Blood of my enemies. Oh, Word around my neck. <laughs> oh, so about tomorrow's career, okay? I have absolutely nothing planned. <laughs> I don't have a single song that I plan 
Oh no. Singing. <laughs> now what? It's gonna be a chaotic stream. It's all gonna be. It's all gonna be suggestions and uh, whatever I feel like singing in the moment. I just thought you should know. Do not come pre prepared for like high quality, amazing karaoke. We're gonna get the most scuff stream to ever scuff. Just so you know, I'm warning you. Scuff wall. You're probably gonna get the meme songs. You're probably gonna get at least one Hotel California and at least one Wonderwall. I tried fixing my reverb as well. I don't know if you remember, but Hotel California, I tried doing the reverb and uh, it was weird. I tried fixing it. Ah, uh, past. I think that it sounds a little better now. Less echoey. Uh uh. <laughs> Yeah, way better? Okay, good, good. I was testing it before and I think I got it fixed. My settings got messed up. <laughs> okay, doesn't sound like I'm in a cave. That is what we're going for. <laughs> yeah. No more cave some door. I don't know why I got amped up so much. I might have accidentally spun one of the dials. Now let's think about her cells. Think about it. Point it out. I mean, I'm willing to, willing to entertain it. How do you even draw it, Ponytail? You can't see it. You cannot even see it. You cannot see it. The original Ponytail. Karaoke from the bottom of an abandoned well. I am Samara Morgan. Ooh, I am coming to kill you in seven days. I will come to your house and kill you. You better bring cookies, side tell. Mm. I don't like side tells that much. Not on me. I'm not that much of a side tell person. Twin tail. I have so many twin tails planned though. The tails? <laughs> I can't undo that. <laughs> Double side buns. See, this is the issue now we've been through every hair so we have done all of them. We've already done the wall. Hmm. Bread. Would not make the modeler's life really hard. <laughs> what is that shape, dude?
Unless it was just the normal hair, but I'd put little, little twin tails here. How would that be? That might be cute, and then maybe ribbons. Yes. I think what I'll do is I'll go grab the normal hair then. I'm gonna have to open my model file to do that. And I don't really wanna do that on stream. Just because, uh, one second. I'll just switch to here for a second. Cause, uh, I don't wanna show anything. Oh, now it. I don't wanna show. If you like Twin Tails, uh, that's good. <laughs> That is all that I will say. Too many secrets, who knows what's in there. There could be anything in those files. Perhaps. Perhaps some government, oh no, I crashed. I didn't save the file. Oh god, yeah, with new Sylvie. No, that's, that's, on, oh, it's fine, okay. That's Sylvie's false. No mind, there could be anything in there. I'll leave it up to your imagination. Let me just render my own hair one second. So I'm gonna remove every file except the hair. No neck, no face. Nothing, only hair. Oh god, this is terrifying. What have I done? Wait, how am I gonna put this over? Oh, we can just remove the front hair, duh. We'll remove the ribbon, we don't need those. Where's the ribbon? Okay. There's so many secrets. Sport Pinsy. Oh, let's put it in downloads. Where's downloads? Excuse me. Sure, where's the downloads? Look off. The forehead will never be released. I know some VTubers have models where they're like, ooh, look at that cute forehead. For me, I think my forehead is. I think it is too advanced. <laughs> I have a level 10 forehead. I think it's illegal for me to show it in public. I'll make it arrested. Anyway, here's my hair disembodied from my scalp. Don't worry, that's normal. Oh god, I'm gonna have to erase everything. Okay, well. Is that right? Is that where and how my hair goes? complicated on the web. Things wrong. 
kids. If this is a lesson in mooding. Maybe asking yourself in the saddle, how do I merge? Just do it, not like I did it. That's your only lesson here. I will not teach you how to do it correctly. I will only teach you not to do what I did. If you want to do it correctly, go somewhere else. <laughs> this is the part of the scene where you go, Shadow, what are you talking about? You should say that. Or I not expect to see you saying, Shadow, what are you talking about? The evil hair must be released. Oh no. <laughs> Don't you just love it when I'm laughing at something that isn't funny? The only person who thinks it's funny is me. Nothing, nothing, I do. nothing. Perfect. It is new. Yes. Pretend nothing happened and we'll do it all. Oh my god, it's new. It is new. Good is new. Now everyone should be seeing each other. Wow, you're amazing. You're, you're magic. Why are you not making all of my models? And I say, but I am. And then I become your life to the mom you don't have a choice. No choice. Yeah, I've been using Shy for a long time, Kiao. You get used to it. You get used to it. Look, absolute genius play. Back to normal. Genius, shadow genius. And then we add the little. Shy is very good. It's as good as any program. We make the model of his life very easy by just adding the little twin tails. Like so. Yes. Praise me more. Come and take good. Maybe not like that. Maybe short. The baby twin tails and the rocks were. Do they have to defy gravity, perhaps? Sometimes your twin tails just need to defy gravity. Anime lessons with Shano. Sometimes twin tails that listen to the laws of gravity are boring. Watch real learning. Why does anyone watch my work streams? All I do is spread lies. <laughs> Misinformation the scene. Salvi! Hello! How you doing? Are you having a good day? Yeah, round earthers. If if gravity is real, then explain my twin tails. Oh, this is cute. This is a good idea. I'm genius. Genius. Huge brain. These are cute. My declaration. Cute. <laughs> Cute. The cute police.
Nina, Nina, you please come in to arrest you. Sure, you are too cute. You're getting arrested. You have to come with me immediately. No choice. I will now read you your right. You have the right to come ahead. You have the right to give me hugs. You have the right to princess carry me. You have the right to. Yes, hugs. <laughs> no, you don't. You have the right to. Come to every scene. Not the right to fall in love with me. Not the right to never ever leave. Not the right to buy a really big hat and wear it. It's a pretty good right. Yeah, isn't that awesome? Imagine having so many rights. I don't know what country we're in, but it's definitely not the United States. Princess Kara is your favorite right? That's also my favorite right. What a coincidence. I think it's done. I don't think there's anything else I can add. It's a pretty simple idea. I think it came out cute. I declare the outfit cute. The back? It's kind of hard to design. Stripes? They're not leggings, size or tights. I think it's nice. I think it's simple but nice. No, the idea if it was leggings, the feet would be bare. Leggings are pants. Sweater and tights is the idea. Yes. Stripes? No. The idea was a sweater and tights, not stripes. Okay. We're gonna... We're gonna do some... Uh... Tsuki... Tsuki... What are you talking about? None of those. Oh yeah, the inner skin. That has striped socks. Not leggings or tights. Socks. <laughs> okay, we're gonna work on the... We're gonna work on the bunny doing. I don't really know what to do for the background on this one. Oh. Where is it? There's too many freaking. The diner. The version you see on the thumbnail is slightly different because I upped the camera size and I resketched it. I don't really know what to do with the background though. I threw it in like a window. It's kind of basic. Maybe basic is okay. 
。另外。Swan and the like that is the she that is the one that she have been having. I don't know what to put the. I do not know what to put the. I tried adding adding like a tank top or something, but it didn't look right from this angle. Is this really a boy? There doesn't need to be a light glare tied. Stop making it weird. There doesn't need to be any of that. You didn't even know it. I mean, no, there's there is nothing bad visible. There wouldn't be anything bad visible. I didn't consider adding like a T-shirt. We could try it. Cause I was staring at this for like 20 minutes, trying to figure out what to put there. I tried like a crisscross tank top thing, like my dress, but it doesn't look right. I don't want this to be a lie. It doesn't look right. <laughs> this angle is weird. I could just leave this how it is. It would be fun if we left it how it is. There is nothing bad showing. It would just be skin hair. Everyone will make it weird because I do kind of like how it looks right now. I don't want to have to cover this chest line really. But anything I put there looks weird. <laughs> or at least head. Don't put anything. Put it to the top. in the wrong place for one. supposed to be a boy. But when I wear onesies, I don't wear anything underneath. I don't have a collarbone to freaking work. Would like the collarbone please to come to my stream please? Explain to me. Yeah, I probably should have zipped it up, but it looked cute with the sleeping like this. I 
guess you could do the tank top thing for being the canvas. I'm slipping the canvas. I do not line on one layer. Thank you very much. I don't even scared to one layer. I don't wear things like this, so I guess it doesn't really matter. I know when people always make it weird. That's why I'm worried. I would have, if, like, if it was up to me, I would have just left it. But I'm cautious now. I don't want people to see me in a bad way. Or see me as a... Basically, I don't want any of you to think I'm drawing, like... I don't know. I don't want think people to think I'm... Etsy artist, because my intentions with this image were not that. I just wanted it to be cute, so maybe we cover up a little more. Mm. I mean, I'll definitely have drawn things that are a little big a lot. But I don't want this to be like that. I want this to be pretty. Just cute. Maybe this could look like a tube top. What do you think? Society. Society is gonna make a little bit of nudity weird. I would say maybe I'll do a, a version without the tube top. <laughs> there wouldn't even be anybody to post. on their channel where we post Lou down and the girls sometimes. They took my took my Twitter. Took things from us. I don't know, I don't get it. You can't even post Lou things. Never mind. Like not nude nudity. The Simmons isn't word at all. But I have to cover everything still. I just feel like you can uh you can show a little skin without it being rude. I don't know, like if I left this how it was, I wouldn't have seen this as a rude image. Society. <laughs> yeah, they're going back to us. They basically, uh, the, it was just a bot response. No one actually reviews the appeals. Not anymore, anyway. Maybe at some point, but nowadays, no one reviews the appeals. Maybe that could make this cuter. Yeah, this girl would just bot replies. I don't actually have anyone reading those, unfortunately. Well, yeah, they're too busy simping. They will simp for big YouTubers, but smaller ones can go for themselves. This girl does not give a fuck.
But I'm a bigger John, I'm not a bigger VTuber because if the school came simping to me, I'd probably be like, fuck you. <laughs> Freak off. You're about me for no reason. Go fix your platform, stinky. I don't think it's cringy to be like, oh, we are, we are so hip, kids. Oh, look at us, we're simping for VTubers on main. Look at us, we are hip and quirky. Use our platform. I hate when companies do that. Dude, just deliver me the product. I don't give a frick if you're hip and quirky. I don't care, I just want I just want somewhere to talk to my friends. Oh my god. We're so cool. Look at us using slang in the patch notes. Ooh, we're awesome. Shut up. Shut up. I don't care. <laughs> Silence corporate account. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, Nervivon. Oh, I'm behind on rewards, sorry. Disingenuous is hack. They're not doing it because they're actually cool and hip. They're doing it to try and attract the user base. Cringe. 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 Bleh. <laughs> voice line. Oh no. Oh god, I gotta... I gotta drag this voice out of the closet. Oh no. Oh no, oh no, I'm this good. You are so quirky. Oh no, oh no, oh no, I'm this good. Oh no, oh no, I'm this good. Why does it have to be on me? Oh no, oh no. Oh no, this good. I've been good. Oh no. <laughs> it makes me laugh too. I will start changing so far. Oh. How the bars are called very real fat. Does you know that running a corporate comp will lead you to the fourth way of hell? If you are running a corporate account, you go to the just a fourth layer of hell. You don't even want to know what's on the other layers of hell. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Alco, you are a local holy hack. For some chat, but you are subscribed. Awesome. Okay. I think that looks alright. Mm -hmm. Maybe the slime moves just a little bit. Up here. A little bit. There you go. Yeah. A bit dumb. Wanna see a magic trick? No, I do not want to see a magic trick. I hate magic. First, hold out your soul. I'm a Viking player.
Not even the magic of that. That is magic. What is the natural process of humans? Because you hate being alone. Humans are social creatures. How do the tarts even work? They go underneath the armpits. They're not so good if you have big boobies. But if you have no boobies, then it'll be okay. They're pretty tight. Usually this in the top is elastic. Judo Sam, please. They're pretty tight to the touch. There are no boobies, man. It's too top fit good. Yes, boobies, man. It's not so good. Anatomy hard. Funny thing about me is, I don't actually know how anatomy works. Typically, I just know if something looks right or wrong, and I move things around depending on that. <laughs> I'm literally a fake it till I make it artist. You heard it here first, folks. And I'll keep faking it until I make it. Cannot stop me. I lead this artist who say you need to learn a certain way. Cannot stop. Having a good eye? Uh, it's not so much that, more than so practice. Anyone can get to this point because I didn't used to be able to do that. Do you know what I mean? No idea what I'm doing. I think we're ready to run. That's a little crap. I don't care enough to do more. a little bit. I hope to God no actual artists are watching right now. I'm cringing. The idea of any artist like a higher skill level than me watching my stuff makes me want to cry. Do not perceive. No, I've never done anything like that. Oh God, new <laughs> <laughs> no, that is not what I mean, Kiel. I mean, when like an actual pro artist shows up, I'm like, be gone. I do it a lot, no matter what level. There are so many good artists in the chat. Mm. 
more and more art friends, more art people showing up recently. I am scared. There didn't used to be like many artists I recognize that showed up to my scenes. But now there's multiple people who I look at and like I know them from being an artist. And I've interacted with them as a VTuber. It's so weird. The VTuber community has brought so many different communities and people together and it's so weird. It scares me. Like I'll see artists on Twitter or wherever. And then I'll see them in my chat and I'll be like, uh oh, okay, bye bye, everyone. Scene's over, I'm leaving no more art ever on scene. <laughs> it is my innate level of do not perceive me, but times like a hundred. You're an artist, do not perceive me. Even if you don't think you're a good artist. No, I don't I don't even think that I will him. I'm sure the majority of good artists do not see art of a lesser quality and be like, you must, you must fix this immediately. You must, that is incorrect. This line must be one nanometer over. Like, I don't think any good artist, well, most of them, would backseat someone else's art because that's something most of these stinky heads do. And, I think most people that have grinded art for long enough to get good are very resistant of stinky head brain power. Does that make sense? I think most good artists have experienced stuff like that at some point. And usually the people doing that are not artists. They're just random people who are like, hmm. I think this would look better if you studied anatomy more, or you should do this to get good when they don't even do that themselves. Because I've had so many people like backseat art before. Dude, just let me draw. I think, yeah, unless, like me, obviously, amateur artist, but when people come to me and they're like, yeah, I don't want to learn to draw, I'm like, do it. Do it, stupid hat. Do it, stinky. Do it right now. Why am I whispering? Do it. Do it. I feel like if I started taking art too seriously, I would lose all enjoyment. Like if I started thinking, okay, let's go. Shadow grind set. Let's, let's do some anatomy sketches. Let's. Let's do this, do that. I think I, I would stop treating it as, you know, a fun hobby and I would start treating it as like an obligation. And I'm not ready for that. Exactly, Siki. I don't think artists, these other artists working is like, hmm. Mm hmm. Usually it's like, wow, that's cute. Or, wow, that's awesome. I like how you do this because we know that we artists know artists of all levels I think including myself we know that the best feedback is supported feedback and that makes you want to draw more negative feedback just makes you feel crappy I've had plenty of old quote unquote friends that have been mean about my art before and being a brat, but I'm pretty sure I've surpassed them all in level now, even though I started drawing like years later than all of them. <laughs> you brat. Thing, but I definitely think I've improved a lot since I began. And uh, I may not have learned the organic way or the way you're quote unquote supposed to learn, but I did learn and I did improve, so I think that means that my knowledge has like some kind of value to it, even if it's not traditional value. 
obviously I cannot advise you the way that a pro artist would, a pro art teacher would, but I like to support people and encourage them to go for it in whichever way they think is best for them. Because everyone learns differently. Everyone has a way of doing that will help them personally the most. It's of course about how you want to pursue art as well. If you're trying to make a career out of it. If you're trying to just have fun and draw cute anime girls. Because that's going to drastically change what you should do. Let's see if I can figure out this one. Yeah. Above there, above there. Yeah, good enough. Okay. <laughs> yeah, having fun and doing is good, but I know a lot of people start drawing because they want to, you know, do commissions or make money. And that's fine too, but I'm probably not the best person to ask if you want to be like the best technical artist out there, because that's not my thing at all. I just want to draw cute anime girls. Yeah, I think there is definitely a portion of artists suffering that think the only way to be good at art and the only point in learning is to be like objectively the best artist imaginable. And that definitely isn't true for me. I don't care about being like number one ranked artist on Pixiv level, but I just want to draw things that make me happy and make other people happy and have fun. Because for a long, long time I wanted to draw. I was too much of a freaking baby to just do it. What is this collarbone? Questions? Okay, good enough. Makes me happy, good enough. Oh, a tablet's fallen. People are asking for commissions. This mindset is refreshing, well, I'm glad to hear that. For me, I started drawing because uh, I was too broke to commission people and uh, I wanted to draw my cute OCs. <laughs> Basically, I do wonder that if this had happened at the time when I would have had skin money. <laughs> I probably wouldn't have learned to draw if I had income when I wanted to draw. Sorry if I can't have made you over mommy. For me, or it's just about having fun. Being good. I mean, of course I want to be good. I don't wake up and think, mm, yes, I want to be the worst artist ever. <laughs> yes. That's my goal. <laughs> what a Sigma grind said so that would be. So, uh, I'm fine with being mid-tier forever if it means I'm having fun with it. Because I don't have that many hobbies that I find fun anymore. To be honest. So I kind of will cling to art desperately. Hands, man. Why does it feel like every art she might end up rambling like a maniac? I'm fat and I do not hands, I use my own hands to appreciate it. Tiny little baby hand. 
It's because my hands are tiny little baby hands. <laughs> my goal as an artist today is to shoot everybody that looks at my art. Mm, yes. To be honest, that's my goal too. <laughs> Do not proceed. Better not count any of your perceiving. Mm -mm. Something I noticed recently when I uh, been watching artists is I love artists and they draw hands. They draw they draw the pointer finger. And then for these fingers they draw just like din din din. And then they draw the pinky. And I've been doing that and it makes my life a lot easier. There is a tip. Tip for you. Only draw four fingers and separate the middle one. <laughs> God, sounds I hear him. The hand test. Zoom out and squint on it. Does it look like a hand? Problem is when you separate them, how do you put them back together? What do I look like some kind of master hand drawer to you? Someone's gonna answer that seriously, you're not smack you, don't you there? <laughs> I'm so needless to be aggressive today. I'm so sorry. Those fingers look like spaghetti noodles. That's okay. <laughs> Sometimes I think your fingers should look like spaghetti noodles. Hmm? I think it's good for them. <laughs> I think it's healthy for your fingers to be spaghetti noodles. If it bothers me, I'll fix it later. That's the grind set I'm on. Or no, I don't care. Can I know my fingers? Will it bite hard? Maybe not. Very gentle, perhaps. I was really happy with how these sleeves look and now I'm reflecting and they were just okay. Truly, being an artist is great. You finally think something looks okay and then you decide an accident. I lied to myself. And now I'm always joking, like with advice to be an artist. Are you ready for the serious or artist advice? Are you ready for the real, real, real moment here? Ready for me to get real? You wanna be an artist? Don't. <laughs> don't. <laughs> Just don't. You 
Screw you already dropped. It's too late, James. It's too late. You have cursed yourself and your entire bloodline for the next seven generations. What have you done? I've been considering getting one of those uh, little dolls that sits on your desk and you compose it. You know, I don't really have enough space for that. I didn't see one, usually they're just like basic man and woman proportions. But I saw one the other day that was like... Pretty small, you know what I mean? Petite. More in line with... The solid drawing on this. Those are nice. But, uh... I don't have the best space. I know the look like Mama is, is one of those. Kind of a little less chunky. Chunky, huh? I like to draw the hand because I only know where some of it is. It's like, like that, and then where's the thumb in all this? Where's the thumb? <laughs> <laughs> where is he hanging up? Okay. Should it be visible? Should the thumb be vi vis visible? Does he exist? Are we perceiving him? Alright, well, we'll leave that there for now. If it looks weird, I'll just delete it and pretend the thumbs don't exist. <laughs> Look on the sad of art, where sometimes we just pretend thumbs don't exist. This animal survives living in the thumbless paradise. <laughs> it's almost to remind me to sing Gangster's Paradise tomorrow. <laughs> Hi, Jake! Oh no! No, it's another good artist! We decided that all artists that perceive me receive the death penalty. Because <laughs> I'm embarrassed. It says my mom actually, not even. You don't even have to be a pro artist anymore. Or even a really, really good artist. You're an artist. You're an artist. An artist. And see what she saw immediately. I don't know, I'm getting over it. Anyone? Getting over it. Anyone who's been here longer than a while will know that I've gotten a lot better with art on the scene. I can just draw and be like, yeah, that's awesome. I love drawing. That's true. I love it when, like, 200 people watch me draw. That's my favorite thing. That was a gas limit. Do not actually tell me how many people are here. Unless it's less. Then maybe that's okay. <laughs> Seven billion. Gosh, darn it. Everyone on Earth is watching my stream again. <laughs> Brazil. <laughs> I 
always forget that the entirety of the Brazil watch is those scenes. How can I forget such an important fact? There better not be more than two viewers right now. The entirety of Brazil is watching me draw. Well, that is some pressure. That is some freaking pressure. Holy heck. I've never been under so much pressure in my life. My tummy is rumbling. Have we been going nearly three hours? It doesn't feel like it. I'm not gonna have to go proud of my nose soon. How does this work? Where does the arm... Is it not? That's good enough. Okay, thank you for continuing your gift sub. Holy heck, thank you. Thank you very much. Gonna get a snack? Mm, no, cause then I'd have to go up, down, up, down, up, down. Takes too long. Everywhere is Brazil. No, Brazil is Brazil. You're all from Brazil, right? Cause you know, having the entirety pop population of Brazil watching me is enough pressure and I don't know if I can withstand even more viewers than that, so... Please tell me you're from Brazil. Even if you're not from Brazil. Anyone who's actually from Brazil must be so confused. <laughs> Rapid Fire, thank you for continuing your good song. Thank you. Is Brazil real? I mean... Are you implying I don't have like a gazillion viewers right now? This is where the tummy goes. I've never drawn a, a onesie before, actually. I don't really know how they work, I just guessed. Well, actually, that shouldn't surprise anyone. If you've been watching me draw ever, you'll know that if I'm drawing, it's like, okay, well, I guess how that works. And we just, we just hope it's remotely close to the real thing. Like this, like, pose, no idea how that one works. This is also a guess. And this is... Everything I know about anatomy is pretty much just what I picked up from looking in the mirror. Actually, I don't like commenting now. And seeing anime or I guess. Just perceiving other people dying. I gotta get better at drawing boobies in general, cause I don't really know how clothes work on them. Cause I'm a bot <laughs> I'm too stupid and all. A lot of artists, yeah, I think a lot of people do. Makes a lot of sense. It does also explain why we went through the discussion the most at all. Japanese artists are women. <laughs> How we discovered that? Because what is this noise that keeps going off? Is that the donation song? I'm seeing it. Oh gosh, it's thrown. Oh no, did someone figure out that I already saw it? My, my game with that is to really sock the throne and not tell anyone I've done that. And see how long I can survive before it gets bought out again. <laughs> yeah. I like. Oh goodness. Zuki. Zuki brought me a bunch of candy. <laughs> Thank you, Zuki. Feed the shondo and bought me mini eggs. I have chocolate eggs, 
add some candy, add some Warther's Originals. <laughs> Thank you, Zuki. Thank you, you want too many. See, this happens every time. Every time I refill it, one person is like, <laughs> and buys everything. And then everyone else on planet Earth is like, Shadow, when are you going to refill the throne? Shadow, when will you put more on the throne? Thank you, Zicky. Thank you. Thank you, thank you. Put a phone on the phone. I don't have any space for it. A little. You know my chair? It's been freaking clawed to pieces. Oh boy, I love having a cat. I'm gonna get a cat, I said. That's a great idea, I said. Good idea, Shondo, get a cat. Get a cat with a PVC leather chair, good idea. Great plan, kiddo. Was that I was lying. Yeah, he's cute and very oh gosh. <laughs> he's cute and very nice. But also every single year has cat scratches and or bites. He's uh You know, I left my tablet plugged in and I woke up today, this today, to see that, you know the little thing that plugs into the tablet? Like the little wire thing. It has been true to freaking pieces. It has all the little bite marks in it. If you can hear that, that's me scratching his little teeth marks. <gasps> Precious, thank you. Thank you for the 1,500 bits. Holy crap, thank you. Thank you for the wonderful scene so far. Good night. I'm looking forward to seeing the complete artwork. <laughs> I will do my best. I'll do my best to make it good. Thank you so much. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Thank you. And good night. I hope you have a very good rest. Yes, yes. Oh, he has a scratching pulse. He has like a taller scratching pulse. It has two scratching posts on it. And the, like a little sitting area he can go inside. And then a sitting part on top. But unfortunately, it's downstairs, and my bed is upstairs. So this means that at night time, I keep the door shut so that he cannot just wander around the house and get lost. So that means that he can do evil things like chewing and gnawing my things. I cannot just let him up free with my knife. It will chew and bite and scratch everything. Everything. Not a good idea. Demi Urgot, thank you for four months. Thank you very much. Thank you. Managed to get a little one for the room. Unfortunately, I don't have the space even for a teeny tiny scratching pose. I bring his toys upstairs and he plays with them on my bed because there's no floor space. Nocturnal creatures. He actually sleeps most of the night. If I get in bed, he'll just come beside me and go to sleep. If I'm awake though, like working, he will uh, not go to bed without me. He's like a child. I'm not going to bed until mama goes to bed. He's a cringe ass ninny baby. I just stopped for a second after I said that because I said cringe ass and then I was like, is that a slur or a swear word or something when I went to say nene? Do you ever just stop and rethink your actions for no reason? <laughs> now 
again like go to say something and I'm like, can I say that? Can I say? <laughs> can I say nay nay on Twitch? <laughs> Is that allowed? No. Oh no, I'm gonna get arrested. Uh oh. Well, we had a good round, boys. What are we doing today? Hi Kira, we are drawing... We are drawing Bunny Sundar. I'm Rabbit. Pew. Pew, pew, pew. Yeah, how you have like the illusion of depth, you know? Okay, let's read it. We do this. And the sound, my brain is working. Isn't that awesome? Like that. Yeah. Some of those glad it all figured out. Oh yeah, I had a dream that I was locked up in the hospital. Nobody came to pick me up. I was there forever. It was really scary. I haven't been in the hospital in a really long time. Probably in my... World record. Now this is there forever and this and I couldn't leave. They kept giving me drugs that made me sleepy. I don't know if I was actually at a good hospital or was it evil liar hospital. not tell you, but I just know it wasn't fun. Nothing, nothing, nothing. It's evil. Man, circles are hard. Yeah, they took all my medication off me. And they said they gave me their medication, which is the worst when you go to the hospital and they switch any medication you're on. Leave me alone. And they locked me in the hospital room and I asked if I could go outside. I know it must have been pretty bad, right? If I was asking to go outside, but I asked to go outside, they said no. They locked me in. It was not a good hospital. I read it zero stars on Yelp.
Is Yelp even a real thing? Why is there so much say I bet I've never been on Yelp? Does Yelp exist? <laughs> Why does that feel so funny? Is it real? It is. Awesome. I'm glad to know this. Thanks for the knowledge. Today I learned something new. This town seems to be building better hospitals. That would be awesome. I would definitely want to do another Charlie Sam someday. Maybe the last ambus is maybe like 12 hours across two days. Like I stream 12 hours one day and 12 hours the next day. 12 hours I can do easy peasy, no sweat. But I have learned that about 14 hours is my limit. Consume for about 14 hours, fine. Doesn't even hit me. Then after that, <clears throat> not so good. Which disease will I kill next? All of them. Or create a utopia. Create disease. The only disease is me. <laughs> Eliminate all the disease competition. But I also in my my evil dream I ate potatoes, but they tasted bad because everything tastes bad. Even in my dreams. Even in my dreams. That could have been the one good thing that dream had to offer me delicious food, but alas. Nothing. Charity for my cooties funds. Never. You will have my cooties forever. <laughs> I'm gonna go call them and was really fast. I'll be as fast as possible, so don't go anywhere. Mm -mm. No going on this thing. I'll be right back. Yes.
吗？所有都吃吗？妈妈下了的下给你，希望你的睡得来。Also, I did grab a small snack. Cause my tummy is very rumbly. Well, I saw my tummy went like grrr, grrr, angry noises. Boo. Yeah, I'm on my hold. I'm gonna pour some more water on you. I don't know where to put my glass. Do not spill it. Do not spill it. Do not spill it. Entire scene, and uh, the glass is maybe like five hundred milliliters. I often drink a little later, maybe two, three. I've not drank about a liter and a half. Big sippy. I have to focus on drawing more hydrating. I saw a Snack also convenient to eat while swimming. You just stick it in your mouth and go. <laughs> yeah. Thank you very much. How are you doing? Ah、oh, man! It's 
another good artist. I'm molding. <laughs> Can't we have vandal artists from the art streams? <laughs> Where do they keep coming from? <laughs> Where do they keep coming from? Man! In five minutes, probably because he's gonna appear and he's gonna be like, Hey, hey Sando, how you doing? Something serious did happen, okay? My dignity, my pride. Sound is the only artist. Mm, I don't know who acting kind of sauce. A little bit of Mogus, perhaps. Mm? A little Mogusy. Perhaps you could be the imposter. Yeah, we have a bunny onesie, enjoying a bunny onesie. We had a charity stream at the weekend. And, uh, one of the, the goals was that everyone could vote on a costume for me to draw myself in. Um, a bunny onesie one. I was originally gonna draw the hood up, but I tried doing that a few times. And every time I did that, the, uh, the hood was like, you wouldn't be able to see much of the hair, you know what I mean? And it looked kind of weird, so I decided not to. Shadow go pyong pyong pyong. Pion, 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 pion. Yeah, so I thought it was like, or the ear was real, or they taped to my skull. Who knows? It's a mystery. Um. sit there and I'm like, <laughs> boobies. Ha ha ha, boobies. How do you draw boobies with a straight face? <laughs> <laughs> boobies, funny. Can't, I know you've drawn some, some pretty interesting artworks. You go, ha ha ha, boobies. How do you take it seriously? Oh, you draw it. You draw stuff like that, girl. You also go, haha, boobies. Oh no. I wouldn't be able to draw if I was too busy going, haha, ha, boobies, the whole time. With a straight face. <laughs> no, again. I don't know. I always have this assumption that all oh, this time draw mood images or like. Hardcore. <laughs> I guess that makes no sense, but I was really much like the real artist. Is that weird? Draw between the ha ha's. Wow, hats off to them. They can draw and laugh at the same time. That's amazing. I could never. Yes, 
sun. Does me when join boobies? Yeah, I've only actually drawn boobies once. They were BBs. Over the enough practice. I don't think I really want to be a booby artist. I mean, it's nice enough to have to draw clothes, but I prefer cute drawings over blue drawings myself. Like drawing them. I like to do a movie that will make your heart explode. Hardcore booby artists have practiced for 50 years drawing boobies in the monastery for the day they can draw these on the boobies, but still, still in bed, they cannot draw boobies without laughing. Mm -mm. I always really like designing cute outfits as well as well. If I had all the time in the world, you would see a shadow of every caliber. You would see mag magical girl shadow. You would see school girl shadow. You would see... Mm -hmm. Shadow is an unnecessarily big hat. You would see, you would see cute summer bikini shadow. You would see shadow eating cookies. Mm. All the stuff you're missing out on. All you have to do to get it, to get the cute stuff, is to permanently alter the flow of time so that there's more hours in the day. That's all you need to do. That's it. Clone me. If that was two shadows, is you like that shadow more than me? What if I'm already the clone? I don't know, I think maybe... Maybe playing Soma messed me up. So like the, ooh, you weren't a person, you were just a robot all along. You know, it was just an artificial intelligence of a person who was alive. Not a real person. What if we were all just artificial intelligence? Maybe I'm not the real Shadow. Maybe the real Shadow died long ago. Maybe I'm just a replacement manufactured to entertain you. Maybe once the stream ends, I'll just shut down until it's time to stream again. Which is not even a real person. Mm -hmm. You are the clone. All shadows are precious. Maybe two shadows would be okay. I mean, I mean, if you, if you have, you have a lap, you have two legs on it, that means at least two shadows can comfortably sit there. Yeah, you only have two hands. Absolutely. Sound pad? What is a sound pad? I don't know what that is, but I'm gonna answer yes. How do you process carry to the shadows? You have to get really, really, really strong. 
If you want to live in a universe where there is two shadows, the sacrifice has to be that you have to get really, really sure to carry them both at the same time. Is this a sacrifice you're willing to make? <laughs> Willing to take on the challenge. <laughs> I'm so funny. How do I come up with this stuff? The boys are hard. How do they even work? Has anyone figured out what a sound pad is yet? Are you really gonna make me Google this? Hmm. Soundboard. Can you imagine how many songs I have to record to be a soundboard? Can you imagine? This is like the biggest conspiracy theory I've ever heard. Everything I say is just a pre-recorded line. <laughs> uh, this is a huge conspiracy theory. Damn, that's crazy. Wait, this one that way. 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 So this one does not exist. You're not proceeding. Man, we're doing zip on that one. Oh no, I'm looping. Oh <laughs> uh, yes, I pre-recorded the entire series. <laughs> See how long it takes before we notice? Uh, we might be able to make it to the hellos. Cause I don't think I could pre-record a line for everyone. Um, <laughs> Do not right click my voice. Guys, seriously. Seriously, guys. For real. For real, do not right click. Please. Guys, I'm being serious right now. I'm not kidding. Do not right click it. It's my original NFT. I bought it fair and square, guys. Guys, for real, please, I'm begging you. God damn it, we gotta figure out how the ham works yet again. I'm tired of this. Ham goes this, that's a ham, that's how it works. Some goes here, goes down, goes down. That's not how this works, dummy. And how they do work, but that's certainly not it. People don't have ears. Um, I don't get it. It's all in my mouth.
Do I just have a specific voice that attracts people asking if I'm using a voice changer? Because I've been in a lot of other Metaverse scenes, and they don't seem to receive it, or if they do, it's not like I do. with in my opinion good voices in me. I know that's a little bit uh it's a little bit subjective. There are some people with pretty good voices out there. I just think my voice is kind of average to be honest. Man I don't know how the hell this work. Don't make me do this. Don't make me do this. These won't. I'm afraid of them. and I'm sure clueless. Drunk? What do you mean drunk? I'm not drunk. Do I look old enough to drink, officer? I think not. Never pull me over for drunk driving again. voice changer mentality because in my opinion it's much more believable that someone can do a very specific type of voice and the machine can emulate it. I'm gonna be honest, I've never heard a voice changer that sounds like a real person. Every voice changer I've sound sounds incredibly, every voice changer I've heard sounds incredibly robotic and very, uh, not like a flesh person. No flesh. <laughs> you guys just listening to this song? Mmm, it's good, it's good. Very comfy remix. Honestly, even if someone was using a voice changer, I don't really... It's obviously because they want to, like, protect themselves. <laughs> Interesting for this tuber. They have this bad audio quality. Oh, that's not really make more sense. It's incredibly, incredibly obvious when someone is using a voice changer. I cannot even think of a VTuber who uses a voice changer. Mm. The only person I can think of is on Twitter, but she uses text to speech that's different. That's not a voice changer. I actually cannot think of anyone. Who actually does? Now that I try to. Mm. Maybe it is her real voice. Maybe she's just a robot. <laughs> oh no. 
no, she's really not. She's trying to take over the world. Oh yeah, there's probably some bobby neck over there. That. in a little bit so I left. Mm. All gone. No more. All gone. So it yeah. can You will have to get you'll have to get a little snack. So not because you, she used to use a higher pitch voice. I actually remember when she had her old uh, design. Cause uh, I didn't actually know they were the same person. For a while. Cause I remember her old design. With the pink hair. And then uh, her new design. When it blew up. And everyone was talking about it. You know, and, uh, yeah. I didn't actually connect they were the same person for a long time. And then I felt like a dummy, but yeah, she wasn't using a voice changer, she was just using a different voice. Which anyone can do. At least as far as I'm aware. She's just talking in a higher pitch. It's changed so like her design completely changed. Yeah, I, I don't think people realize how easy it is to just speak in a different voice. It's pretty damn simple. But I think most people just uh, cannot comprehend that for some reason. Is it seriously easier to believe that uh that there's some magic awesome sounding robot technology then people are just good at manipulating their voice because to me if someone's doing a funny voice my first thought is damn you're good at doing funny voices not oh my god a robot <laughs> yeah i can do anything that i like i don't really care about oh, voice changers what are you gonna do Oh, look at this. Scary voice changer. Isn't it scary? Oh my god, Shadow, stop turning the voice changer on and off. No, I won't. <laughs> <laughs> that is hard. It's hard to change it that much. I to do that for very long. It's like it confuses your brain so much. <laughs> so I'm not like I was <laughs> I've had people say that before, James. 
The one on, because it's, it sounds so weird for someone to switch octaves that fast, that it sounds wrong. So your brain automatically assumes that it's not real. Nope. Uh, I don't know. I mean, <laughs> I am the voice changer. <laughs> Somebody uses a voice changer and you think that of me? No! I am the one who changes voices. <coughs> uh. mm. Yeah. It's a good idea, thank you. so it can't possibly be real. I've never heard someone do that before. I think it's just because it's uncanny, you know? You don't hear someone switch a couple of octaves very often. I don't even know how much of a change that was. One octave, two, I don't know anything about music. What is an octave? What even is an octave? Thank you, Sir Firebunner. Thank you. Today we're talking about funny voices, I guess. It's how do you know when one ends and another begins? Okay, Mr. Music Man. Hello, music people. voice so much. Vocal cords protesting. Since I had COVID, I'm very milkishy. Is that yucky? So I not say that. That's pretty yucky, right? I shouldn't say that, sorry. I know this sound like I'm always sniffly. Like I go sniff sniff a lot more. Like it feels like I always have stuff clogging my, clogging me up. I'm all clogged up. Need to be cleared out. Get out of here. <laughs> Yeah, even if it is a human thing. It is a huge turn off to me when I'm not, just personally when I'm watching a streamer and they talk about like, really personal things. You know what I mean? Makes me feel icky. I feel like things that make me feel, make me feel icky. No, Zephyrin, that's not what I mean. I mean like, icky things. When people talk about icky things. Seems like I'm trying to be comfy when people are talking about stinky poopy. It's like, ew, ew. (laughs) 
No sink, booby. No, there's a what the heck? What the heck? What the heck? Getting what the heck right now? Plus ratio. Big cushion. That is very big cushion of you. <laughs> Your name is very fitting. <laughs> what a fitting name! <laughs> I've never seen a name combo. We're not Kiana. That's the whole freaking point. It's national not do it. Not not win. Being icky does not make you win. Three, thank you for six months, thank you. And Uberham, thank you for four months. Got license for that head punch, got little miss. No, I for sure. What are you gonna do about it? Is it Detective Jack? Yeah, it was. Got him. Detective Jack, hello, welcome. How are you doing? We are joining Pyong Pyong. My tablet is showing Pyong Shadow. Rambit. Benoi. Rabbit the Benoi. Bum 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 bum. Ah! Robot me Walker Squares Okay the story here I'm addicted to these lately 
Because they were like the only crisps that taste normal. Like completely normal. And I eat them and it's like, ah. <laughs> Normality. I didn't used to care about them that much. So now I eat them and I'm like, oh. These are the best. These are the best. So thank you, Lyra. Thank you for the crunchies. I will not get fat. Stop being a feeder. Thank you. I've had discos. Discos are too hard. Feels like you're eating a rock. I don't want to eat a rock. If I was eating a rock, I'd eat a rock. <laughs> if I wanted to eat a rock, I would eat a rock. Hope that makes sense. Rocks are delicious. Debatable. No, I don't enjoy the rocks. They're minerals, Marie. They're minerals, not rocks. Uh, oh, this. We did not like this. Seems like a little heart. How does that make you feel? Awesome, I hope. Hank Ark. Minerals. Minerals. Collecting rocks or minerals seems fun. Seems fun. Now it is time to line the face. No breaking bad spoilers, remember? Mm -mm. Thank you for three months. Thank you very much. Does he break the bad? Does he break the bad in the end? Breaking bad spoiler, they make math. Oh no! Breaking bad spoiler vault his cancer. What an idiot. He should have just lived in 2022. When I destroyed cancer. Has anyone updated the Wikipedia page? <laughs> This is the quarter the cancer is dead. <laughs> Don't do that. <laughs> oh no. I'm just kidding, do not make it work. <laughs> you didn't know that! That's the whole point. It's the whole point, Hi. Have you seen the memes where they're like breaking bad if Walter lived in the UK and it's like two pages? 
you know, because he doesn't have to pay for medical care. So we never start cooking that. Where, where is the Breaking Bad versus Breaking Bad if World Hunt Cancer in 2022 after I destroyed it? Mm. Come on, get on it. Still pain cancer. Get it? Cause cancer is cringe. And it does not deserve to rest in peace. Do you understand? Awesome way. The first, I've been streaming for four hours. <laughs> you shouldn't be impressed by that, that's normal. We stream for four hours, is like almost every stream. some sleep during the stream for the subathon. I think that makes me even more nervous though because at least when I'm sleeping normally I can be like okay well if I cannot fall asleep nothing, nothing, nothing. then uh, if I cannot fall asleep either I'll just sleep in or I'll just survive the day on no sleep, but if I'm streaming all day, then we're gonna have a problem with both of them streamers. Shame or not. My grandma feels fine. 
probably hang out fairly soon though, just cause you I'm hungry. But I do think at least for me personally, streaming for like 12, 18, whatever many hours is good for me. Cause it like builds up my stamina, I guess. Like now, four hours seems like nothing. You know what I mean? Does that make sense? Yeah, I'll have breaks during the subathon. Usually during a subathon, you sleep. I'm gonna have a rule during my subathon though. I've noticed a lot of VTubers are. Uh, this isn't a dig, this is just something I wouldn't do personally. A lot of VTubers during subathons sometimes they're only streaming like 12 hours a day. And obviously that means that 12 hours is like free to them on the timer. So what I was thinking of doing was uh I get eight hours every day where uh, the counter goes down. But say I go for a uh, say I go for a I go off for 10 hours to sleep. I will give you the two hours back to the timer. Does that make sense? So I only get eight free hours of sleep a day, but I can go for longer. Like if I'm gonna crash and sleep for 14 hours, then I'll come back in 14 hours, but I'll give you six hours added to the timer for free. Cause that way I was thinking about it. I wouldn't be able to sleep knowing that if I sleep for 12 hours, that's people's money being ticked away. Because basically, if you don't know how subathons work, say uh, the donation goes up and it goes up to uh, 24 hours, then you can just go to sleep for 12 hours. And that'll go down to 12. I don't know. I don't know. That's what I thought. So everyone would want me to sleep properly. And I would feel really mean for scamming you out of so much money while I'm sleeping. Come on. So basically, if I go for eight hours, I do this mainly because I know when I'm exhausted, I have the tendency to sleep forever. And you know what would be freaking lame? You know what would be freaking lame? Do you want to know what would be lame? If, uh, if we had a subathon and then I went to sleep for 16 hours. <laughs> Because I haven't known to do that on again. <laughs> if I'm like really light. Sleep for 16 hours casually. <laughs> okay, well, you just paid for 16 hours for me to sleep. I will not be streaming for 8 hours today. <laughs> but you have to pay for 24. <laughs> I'm just gonna... So... I don't know. For me, I think that's how I do it. But I would run the subathon to, uh... I think I've been thinking, I'm thinking I'm gonna have to do... I think I'm gonna have to do... Mmm... Oh... Uh, my brain just nuked out. Uh, one sub is gonna add one minute. Do that, but I will be doing it in September. So one sub will cost like four dollars. I think that's probably fair. I was considering 90 seconds to 120 seconds, but I don't want to die. <laughs> I don't know if I can handle like the full hour length subathon. She went, if you didn't know, she went for 69 days of streaming. Which is incredible. But I do kind of worry that if I seemed freaking forever, I may not enjoy it quite as much. Having the ability to sleep as much as I want without worrying about scamming people, and also having the ability to 
or brush. Yeah. I think that would help me to do my very best. And make every hour entertaining for everyone. Yeah. You know, the way it works, Quicksilver, is that usually during summertime, people go to sleep and they leave the timer running, right? They leave the timer running, which sometimes can lead to people disappearing for like 12 or 14 or 16 hours. And the timer still takes on. But, uh, yes, anytime I sleep, I can only knock eight hours off the subathon. But I can go to sleep for, say, ten hours, but then I add two hours to the timer. So you're not losing any more than eight hours of sleep time every night. Because I feel like I'm going to sleep really hard during the subathon from exhaustion. But if I can sleep as much as I want, I think it'll be good for me. Son, the subathon is his favorite sleep. No. No. Mm -mm. No, no, no. I will not permit it. Yeah, I could pause the timer, but I think it'd be easier to add the hours back. Pausing it would mean that it wouldn't go down at all. Or to have to get up after eight hours to pause the timer. I don't know. Mm. I guess I could pause it and then remove eight hours when I get back. That might work. I would have to see how the timer and how it works. Because the one I used for the charity team didn't really do that. I'll think about it. Either way. Yeah. Oh. Uh, Come on, thank you for the thousand bits. I'm working and back to work. They oh, are crap. <laughs> Thanks for the chill lunch break, I'm done, everyone. If you are still looking, thank you very much, thank you. I'm glad you look with us, and thank you for the bits. Mm -hmm. Let's finish this face. Doing the iris is really hard. So this is right. Iris. I think you have to find the timer yourself. I did ask Sylvia about it. But the one she linked me was for OBS. So I may have to ask people that I know have done subathons and use Streamlabs OBS. Cause Sylvie's wouldn't work for me. I use a different program to stream. I don't think Twitch has one built in. Or anything like that even. Hello, that, that stacks. Hello. Yeah, Streamlabs probably does. Because Streamlabs is basically just OBS, but kind of more intuitive. It is more resource heavy, apparently. That's not really a concern for me. Flex is my game on PC. I find it more convenient. This is what I use. I used to use OBS. Um, I used to stream now and again on YouTube, but I definitely prefer streamlabs. Personally. Seen a lot of people having issues. Yeah, like if I couldn't get on the works for a while, or it bugs out or something, we would have to just uh, add time back on manually or set it manually or something. That's a good point. <laughs> My timer fell. That is a good point about. You may be wondering, Sean, why does your tablet fall like twice an hour? It is because, uh, because of all. It's on the very edge of my desk because my desk is tiny. <laughs> so keep slipping. <laughs> Just have 
not a mod count. <laughs> Just count as a second. Yeah, extreme digital art. Art on the edge. <laughs> what are mouses? Okay, yeah, I'll just uh, slide into Iron Mouse's DMs. Real quick. <laughs> yeah, I'll just uh, do that. Thanks. You made her real tight. Could they're open? She has DMs open. Are you kidding me? Oh my god, does she have someone to go through them? That's horrific. I cannot imagine. Oh my god, she must have a manager or something, right? Just when I have DMs open, I get so many strange messages. Not really from fans. Mostly just randoms, you know, scrolling by. Like, uh... I don't know how to, you know, how my new... She goes through them, oh my god. Mostly, what the heck? What the heck? That's insane. Yeah, you know when I have my, uh, my, my new Discord made? My DMs were open for a while because uh, I didn't know how to close them. I had them off, but uh, they were still being received because for some reason Discord has like a secret setting for a server that I didn't know about. Some guy straight up just sent me a video of uh, a kid getting his legs run over by a car. Yeah, and that's why you don't have a gems of <laughs> People, man. Mm -hmm. He was like, Hey, can I show you something cool? You wanna see something cool? And obviously I didn't reply to him because I thought my DMs were closed, so I'm not interacting with anyone who DMs me. I did not reply, so he was like, oops, my finger slipped, and he just sent me a video of a guy getting run over by a car, I guess. And then uh, I actually brought it up to the mods, and someone showed me how to actually uh, Turn it off for real. I mean, I mean that stops most people thankfully, most weird people thankfully, but there is also strange people that will send you stuff to your like business email if they're that dedicated. And I've had people who send stuff to other places I have that do not have DMs switched off because they do have platforms not gonna name them. Where the DMs are open. Still, so I don't really want to close. People do DM me nice things. If you find it, you can DM me there. If you figure out what I'm talking about. If you have something nice to say, you can DM me there. I cannot promise I'll always reply, but I'll uh, probably read it. If I see it. I just don't understand what compels people to be weird. I guess it's just people who have boring or unfulfilling lives, but. Yeah, I think for most people, you can just say it here. No, finding this is not a challenge, so I'm not saying any more than that. Uh, I 
feel like most things that you want to say, you can probably just say here. Unless you have time to talk to everyone properly and respond to every message and I get every nice message. But unfortunately, I know some of you have probably sent me nice messages in the past, but I often do not reply to them. Even if I read it. Because, you know, it takes a lot more time to respond to a message than it does to read it. Do I say that clip? Honestly, I recommend that most people have their DMs off, even just as a random person, even if you're not a content creator. Unless you want to be stumbling across hazardous things, potentially, it's probably best to switch them off or set it to friends only. I think most people have been on the internet for a while, probably already know that. I think we've all received strange, unsolicited images as children. No, so Namington, you've lived a very blessed life. You're so lucky. <laughs> I used to uh, have a phase of law. Uh, my first like online friend group that I had. We talked through the online like message board called uh, I think it's called Chatsy. I don't know if it exists anymore. But uh, let me tell you, most people on there, they were not looking in the chat. <laughs> they were not looking in the chat at all. And young Shadow in that day, fresh face to the internet, Learned many things. Witnessed many horrible happenings. The internet is a scary place. Yeah, I'm going on the internet. That was my first mistake. Shouldn't have done that. Mm -mm. You heard it from here, kids. Do not use the internet. Just don't. It's not worth it. Get off the internet right now. I'm cutting it down. I'm cutting down the internet. Use your voice and it's locked. I think we should go back to the Stone Age, personally. Everyone was probably happier then. <laughs> was it Snowfall? Was it? Hi, Ryan. How are you doing? Feels like I haven't seen you in a while. I'm imagining it. We saw the fault of those damn Victorians wanting to build factories. 
What were they thinking? Idiots! Fools! Oh, yeah, yeah. That's so sweet. I'm glad. Not just me though, it's everyone. Everyone working together to make a nice comfy space for everyone. And I'm very glad to have this community. can be very good. I'm also very bad. My first Discord server started because I wanted somewhere cool to hang out with people. Because I just started making content. And uh, it turned into like this really hateful space. Because a lot of the people there were very edgy, including me at the time. Because I condoned a lot of this behavior as well when I was younger. Because I made that Discord very young. And uh, I saw people being edgy and I allowed it. Even joined in now and again. Really not good. Very shameful looking back. But then obviously I moved on, you know, became a different person, grew up a little bit. Um, Unfortunately, the chamber, echo chamber, just continued long after I moved on, years after I moved on. And I got to the point where I started speaking there less and less, and then not at all. And then it just really did not feel like my Discord. Honestly, it never did. It, uh, even at the beginning, it was like a Discord where, you know, I talk. And not again, like once every blue moon, my videos were brought up. But, uh... It was never really a community server. It was just a really gross place. I've said before that I think everyone deserves a chance to grow up. Because a lot of us are on the internet very young. And a lot of us make a lot of bad decisions and bad lapses of judgment. And uh, we enable the wrong types of behavior. Or we just sound by the wow, the wrong types of behavior. Not behavior festers. And then... Yeah. It got out of control and I could not sound it anymore. So I deleted it. <laughs> but it took months and months of finding the courage to do. It took so long to actually do it. I wanted to delete it for years, but it took so long. So long to finally be like, that's it.
and I remember the the feeling I had when I was finally on it. It's like a weight off my shoulders. God, I hated that too. It's a good way to move forward. Was it before PNG to work? Yes, that server was made in early 2017. <laughs> so five years ago. Jesus, five years ago. I wasn't even born then. I remember when I made the new server and everyone was like actually talking about my content there. It's amazing. It's like, holy crap, this is an actual community server. This is what it's supposed to feel like. It's crazy, bro. Does. We still have a nice community now. This is really nice. Music does fit. I hear commotion going on within the forest, so I think I'm gonna have to wrap up the stream here. Gonna go bonk some forest critters, I think. I'm gonna save the forest elder from the children. We didn't go for four hours and 30 minutes. It really felt like much shorter. We got a lot of work done, I think. Remember we did this? Don't forget about this. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you go to bed right now. You go to bed. Don't go anywhere though, because I kind of want to find someone to wait. Yes. So who we have there? Uh, sweater we design. Oh, hair. <laughs> and then we did some lining. Really productive. Oh, oh, my tablet fell. <laughs> really nice. Oh, I'm sorry. I should have warned you. Oh God, I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. God. Oh God. <laughs> go in that. Go in that. Okay, next stream is karaoke tomorrow. I'm looking at the uh, follower count right now. We were 149 followers away from 30k. Is it possible? Maybe, maybe if we get a good raid or something. It may be possible to hit it in like six hours. I think it is doable, potentially. So, we're gonna try and hit 3k tomorrow. <laughs> During karaoke scene. I have, uh, I have six hours. I can stream for up to six hours, potentially. So depending, yes, there is no plans for tomorrow's scene whatsoever. We're just gonna do whatever. We're gonna do whatever, we're gonna sing whatever I feel like singing, so make sure you come. Yes. So I will be taking suggestions. <laughs> uh, and on Friday we have very, very, very rare early ASMR stream. Mm -hmm. Very rare, extremely rare ASMR stream in the evening. 
And then on Saturday, we're gonna play some idle monitor. Yes. We're gonna play it again, we're gonna continue our black co I mean white company, I mean good company. for coming let's take a look and see who's streaming don't go anywhere don't go anywhere we gotta find someone to freaking raid isn't that awesome who can we raid who can we raid do we feel like a scary bit? there isn't that many people on We could, we could say hi to the TV. She just started. I'm not too scared. I'm not too scared to... I'm not too scared to raid TV. Wait, what is she doing? Oh god, she's not ending, is she? Okay, no, let's, let's just do it. Okay. Something is happening, Walt. Okay. She just started. I'm sure she's not ending. Okay, uh... How do we describe this, this stream? She's gonna call me Shadow the Hedgehog again. I'm cringe raid. Big bang look. This is a scary raid. This is a scary raid. We will say hi to her though, cause I like TV. We were, she was briefly mentioned today too, so... Topical. Topical. There is your raid message. Okay, I'm not scared. I'm not afraid to raid. I do not fear. I'm a big raid, big raid, um, I'm, I'm not afraid, not scary, anti-scary, if there was a list of things that is scary, this would, oh my god, that's a lot, okay, big raid, uh, anyway, we'll go say hi to TV, thank you for coming today, you would like to be, she's very hyperactive, if you don't know who she is, do you live under a rock, do you live under a rock, <laughs> we will go say hi to her, she's very, very nice, very fun, very entertaining to watch, so I will, I'll see you later, I'll see you later, you don't know who she is. Ty lives under a rock, confirmed. Aw, uh, go say hi to her, she's a sword. I don't know what she's doing, it's a mystery, but uh, I'm sure it'll be good. Anyway, thank you for coming, make sure to stop by the karaoke soon tomorrow. I cannot promise I can sing, but I can hopefully promise a good time, okay? So, I will see you later, have a nice rest of your day. I love you very, very, very much. Take care of yourself. Get something nice to eat. Have a nice day. Don't live under a rock. I'll see you later. I love you very much. Bye bye. Bye 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 bye.